Yeah, let's use, uh, back to this, um, let's use hairdressers. You can use hairdressers to, uh, to, or you just want to use value on that. So when you're running that Groupon, you can, um, you can have something to give away. So all these items that you have on your, your Groupon, your listing, and uh, so when you, you know, before you run your Groupon, make sure that you list these items like one chiropractic visit, you get a free tanner. If you can get 30 days of tanning, I'm telling you, you're going to clean up. That is the ultimate sale there. <clears throat> um, that really sells sells and it sells very well so um i there are tanning salons out there that will give 30 days if you can't try to get a week if you can't do that at least get one tanning session from somebody um doesn't have to be uh that close to your gym either so you know all these facilities that you're working with if if you can't find anybody that works with you in your local area remember that these groupon people are coming from all over the place too so remember that there's Groupon, there's Living Social, there's there's Buy With Me, there's Google now has a uh, their own, and uh, just like type in daily deals in your local area and find out who's running daily deals so you can be a part of them and find out the new uh, they're they're launching all all the time. There's new businesses popping up that are doing daily deals. So find out who they are and uh, be one of the first personal trainers to get up on their list and run with them. So. Like I was saying before, we have the, uh, the, 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 the ad is out now. So you, what you have is you've got your clients calling you up. Um, you have a, 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 you're at the computer, you're answering the phone. So when you're answering the phone and you're on the computer typing in the comment sections, you want to make sure that you're answering everybody's questions and uh, that you're informing them to please invite their friends, Facebook this, type it, and continue to type this for the 24 hours that you're that your uh, daily deal is through. So take the day off if you have to and make sure that you're working this, this daily deal to its fullest potential. And I guarantee you that you'll get four times the amount of people if you work it the way I'm telling you. So you're gonna increase the amount of people that buy the daily deal, which will increase the amount of people that'll buy personal training from you when they get to your facility. So now that you have, uh, you have more value to your personal training um, that you're running now. So you have the uh, fat, bla fat blasting and body sculpting, uh, small group personal training uh, for two, So and mark it down for 39 bucks, uh, and uh, just do your best with that. And you know, if, if uh, they don't go for that deal, maybe uh, just lower the, the uh, price mark so you can come down to uh, these days, you know, because of boot camps going out there, they're going as low as $20 uh, uh, per head, and uh, they're doing pretty good with those. But, you know, the, the, what you need to look for is the, the rate of uh, uh, people that are going to really sign with you. Um, you're not truly worried about the, the next 30 days of training, so this is where I'm going to get into teaching you how to uh, take these Groupon and Daily Deal clients and flipping them on day one. So let's get into that now. And uh, let's learn how to flip these people on day one. So you have your clients in. So everybody's gonna come in. You wanna set the schedule up. Uh, they have their, their partners are gonna come in. Not gonna talk any numbers. You get them set. Uh, get the people who are going to call you and set the times and dates with you on the very first day that people show up. This will be the orientation day. It will be just similar to somebody just calling you or you setting up an orientation through any other means of marketing. This is the same thing. You're going to act like you're setting up their very first session and you are, but to you it's an orientation. So you're out to sell uh, uh, a larger package to these people. So what you want to do is get the So you want to schedule your client. Um, schedule your client, and from this point, you're going to uh, go through an orientation. So get the orientation. You want a high energy, passionate, high 
high energy, passionate personal training session. It's an orientation, body diagnostics test, whatever you want to call it. But this is where you're going to find out where they're spending money. Uh, you're going to find out the the objections that they may have against using personal training. Uh, make sure you ask if there's significant others in, in, uh, behind them uh, when, when doing this and uh, be sure to uh, just find out where they eat, uh, how they spend money, if they drink lattes, if they, if they, uh, if they eat out three times a week. Uh, this is money that they're spending that they don't need to be spending and they can be spending it on your services. So by the time you're done with this orientation, do an orientation too that's not just like uh, going through a bunch of machines. A gym, you know, when people sign up for a gym, they do that. You're a personal trainer, you're supposed to rock their world. So show them what's up and get them, uh, beat them up. You know, most women like to do the lower extremities, so if you do a great leg routine with them and you show them that you're the, the best trainer on the earth, uh, do the legs with abdominals. Um, do the legs and, and uh, sculpt the abdominals with it and just burn them out, fry them out. Do the calves, quadriceps, uh, and hamstrings with the buttocks and, and abdominals mixed into there. And uh, use the Swiss balls too, guys. Those work great for the abdominals. Those work great for uh, wall squats and things like that. And use different items. Don't use too many machines when you're doing orientation. This way that they know that you're the expert and that uh, you have more ingenious exercises than just uh, working on machines. Like I said, they can work on the machines themselves. They need you to do exercises that really get them results. So on this next 30 minute session, you need to show them uh, that you're the expert and that you can get this job done. But most people have anywhere from what, 10 to even up to 30, 60 pounds to lose and they can't do that within this 30 sessions. Um, or this 30 days, which is going to be three times a week, by the way. And then you're going to do two personal training sessions with one group fitness class. Because it's going to be basically a boot camp on Saturdays. So you got two personal training sessions during the week with a trainer, 30 minute sessions for two people. And then you're going to do a group session uh, on the weekends. So you want to explain to them that the change is good for their bodies. You know what I mean? So it's still personal training. It's just in group form. So got two times a week with the trainer. And if somebody can't make these boot camps, uh, maybe you want to make uh, two boot camps per week so people are able to make them. It could be a bonus. You know, you could do one on uh, Wednesday nights or something like that at 6 p.m. And then you could do one on Saturday at 8 a.m. And that way everybody has a chance to get this, get their boot camps in and get three times a week in. Um, so, you know, you can get less arguments out of people by going the extra mile, as I always tell you. So, um, let's go to the sale now. So you did a great orientation with them. You're talking to them now. You're at the desk. You're writing down some of the numbers that they told you about. Like you know that they eat out. Both of them eat out uh, three times a week. They're spending on average 20 bucks per meal. That's 60 bucks per week. You know, they can afford your personal training now. So you find ways for them for them to be able to afford your personal training, you're going to teach them that they don't really need to be eating out, that they need to be pre-preparing their foods at home. Or get them on a, uh, a supplement of some sort and have them drinking shakes uh, th three times a week instead of those meals that they're eating out. So um, go over the dollar signs with them. And this is where you're going to take this $30 now. So you're going to take the $39 and you're going to turn it into $100. $150 value. This $150 value comes off of your regular personal training packages. So what you're going to tell them is, look, I've already had people come through this store that already signed with me for personal training because they knew that they needed more, uh, more and longer period of time with me than just this next, uh, you know, next 10 to 12 sessions that you're going to be spending with me. And uh, what I'd like to do with you is is give you what I gave to them and that's a discounted rate off personal training when you sign today because if you don't and you need more time with me I think that I've proven to, my, to you that I'm the expert and that I can get this job done Mrs. Jones so what I'd like to do is discount my personal training packages and have you spend the next six months with me 
on a three time a week basis and that way you won't even have to do those boot camps it'll be me and you together three times a week and you two get to split the cost of it so you guys are spending any you know what a hundred and fifty dollars each so you tell them it's tell them it's four hundred dollars on a regular or uh, you know it's four fifty for your half hour sessions now you're bringing it down to three hundred dollars a month and they only have to spend a uh, hundred and fifty dollars each if they don't do this, then they're going to be, after the 30 days is up, they're going to have to spend the regular price on their, on the personal training packages, and they're going to need it, because this 30 days is just getting them over that first little hump that it takes to get to the, uh, to the real results, which usually come basically after the first month, you know. So if anybody needs to lose 30 pounds in the first month, yes, you could lose 10, you might be losing 5 to 10 pounds with me. Uh, within the second and third month, you're guaranteed to lose 30 doing it my way. I can't promise anything underneath this, this daily deal uh, promotion, but I can promise you if you work with me, we're going to go the extra mile. Here's why. Because not only am I going to give you uh, that great discounted deal, but I'm going to give you an hour-long program per those deals. So what you're going to do is you're going to do 30-minute sessions with them, and then you're going to have them do a 30-minute cardiovascular exercise program right after they're done so you're gonna call it now a program that you've designed just for them and once you get this uh, get them to understand that they're getting an hour versus a half hour now you have built more value towards their per your personal training and it's just fantastic to have people understand this and know that you're the expert and you know what it's going to take to get this weight off of them. You know that they're spending thousands and thousands of dollars and if they really, really want to change their life, you'll get a lot of people flipped this way. So basically all you did was take the $39, you turned that into a $100, $150 value off of your personal training packages, your 30-minute sessions. Then you turn that 30-minute session into a one-hour program, and now you have personal training clients buying your personal training packages, and you spend zero on marketing. So this is a no-cost way to flipping clients on day one using your daily deals. So I want to go into the next uh, promotion that I want you to use in Volume 1 of the Personal Trainer's Bible to a six-figure income. We're going to get into that next. Um, it's going to be people that you basically know and... Uh, you know, a lot of personal trainers out there don't really understand that they're already sitting on a gold mine. And Groupon's one way, but uh, let's say that you Groupon's not ready to run yet, and uh, you, you've signed up for Groupon, and they tell you that you're, I don't know, you're four weeks out from using them. So what you're going to do, you're going to find people uh, that you know, you're going to find people that your trainers know, and you're going to make a list. So I want you to make a list of at least 25 to 50 people that you know. So you're going to make a list of 25 to 50 people that you personally know or have ever, ever come in contact with or uh, maybe have business cards or um, you know family, friends, uh, co-workers, things like that. Uh, your doctors, dentists, chiropractors, whatever it may be and you're going to contact them. So I want you to pick up the phone and you're going to call them and you're going to tell them that you are uh, personal training and I want you to uh, offer them a free personal training session is a fast way but I also want you to ask them who do they know that may be interested in uh, you know sculpting their body and losing some weight with you that you're, you're willing to give a free week away to try your uh, personal training business out. So you're trying to get more leads from these people so you can call more people and uh, get more prospects through the door to turn into more clients. So you have a list of 25 to 50 people now to contact and turn into personal training clients if you make the calls. So all you're doing is making the call to somebody that you already know. Call your mother and father for God's sake. They probably know five to ten people that they can hook you up with. If you've got a good family, you're going to have brothers, sisters, and, and uncles, and, and grandmothers, and things like that. They can get the word out for you <clears throat> and then what you want to try to do is get the phone number and name and phone number of this person and email if you can and then uh, you know send, send a phone call over and say hey uh, you know Mrs. Jones my, my mother sent me over to you she thought maybe you'd be interested in, in uh, trying out my personal training for one week 
Uh, do you have any friends or family? And then you keep the cycle going. So basically you're going to ask them for five to ten people that they know. And then you're going to keep it going. You can keep this going as long as you keep hitting the phones and you keep connecting to people. So if you don't get a hold of somebody too on the phone, don't don't th get discouraged and, and, and just stop making the phone calls. You've got to call these people and basically I don't want you to leave a message the first time around. Uh, what I'd like you to do is try to get a hold of somebody. The best way to, to, to talking to somebody is not by leaving a message. It is by connecting to that person one-on-one, -on, -one, on the phone, or in person. Um, so if they have a workplace or something, you can even go there and hand them one of your uh, gift cards, which we're going to get into for referrals. Uh, and But basically, I do want you to just hang up the phone and don't uh, leave a message because I want you to be able to talk to them. You're going to be able to sell them better on your product than your than an answering machine will. So make sure that you don't leave a message and make sure that you just call them back, okay? So making the calls. I want you to make the calls. You're going to make the 25 to 50 calls and then at the same time you're going to make another list of people that you know. Um, this is just a quick, no-cost uh, way of, of getting you out of the gates. And you know, like I said, if you're running a group on and you're running multiple daily deals, and you may be having to wait, but you know, you don't have any clients, or you got uh, maybe you got 10 clients, and you want to get uh, 20 to 30 clients. It's, you never know. You might you might get five, 10 clients out of this thing, and uh, they might be the best clients in, in in that you've ever signed up. You just never know. And I've been through a lot of things, and I've tried a lot of strategies. And this one's about the easiest one you can do. And like I said, if you're smart about it, you can keep it going for. Uh, you can keep it going as long as people are willing to keep giving you people, and as long as people know people, and you know that people know people. So just keep the cycle moving. Keep calling the people to until you get a hold of them, so you can talk to them personally, and then discuss sharing your personal training uh, for one week with them and a friend. So the reason I'm having you bring multiple people in is because I'm going to try to get you to sell individual packages later on <clears throat> at $250 a month for 10 sessions. And then what I'd like you to do is put two to three people together in one personal training session so you can have your people warm up for 10 minutes. You can have them train with you for uh, 30 to 40 minutes, and then you can have them training on their own for an hour. So I know trainers that set them up to do abdominals on their own. They just show them the, the, the exercises, or they write them out for them on paper and say, here, this is your last half hour. Do this for the last half hour. Uh, doing cardiovascular is one of the best ways to get their body fat down fast and get them slim and trim and make you look like a genius real fast. So basically, everybody that you talk to, it's $250, you're going to get an hour-long program, but you're going to put people together. So I do small group training, two people is probably the best. So if you could do $250 and you're doing $25 at $25, that's $50 bucks per every 30 minutes. If you do that every 30 minutes, that's an hour, that's $100 every hour. And uh, you know, you do that eight hours a day, that's 800 bucks a day. And you know, you multiply that by what, six days a week? and you got $4,800 a week. You do that by three, you're making $12,000 a month. Uh, that's not bad money, guys. So if you can do it my way, you're charging less rates, but maybe some people uh, still want the hour sessions, whatever, just tack it up. You know, Tell them the hour sessions are 600 bucks. If they give you the 600, then you're golden. Um, so that's still 60 bucks a session, and that's good too. So you either purchase the very low cost training, or it's extremely high to be with you for one hour. So those are the best ways I know how to uh, sell personal training too, and it's easy for you to sell personal training at that cost for, for an hour long session basically. So you spend 30 minutes with the client, make sure that they warm up on their own time for the first 10 minutes, and then uh, work with you for 30, and then basically do their own um, personal training or, or their own cardiovascular for the last 30 minutes of the uh, schedule that you have them for that hour. So that's a fantastic way of selling personal training is low cost, 
uh, sell the hours, you know, sell it as an hour program, and I guarantee you, you'll change your whole personal training business by doing that. So I'm going to erase this here, and then we're going to move on to uh, oh another one for you gym personal trainers out there. This is easy here. Uh, I'm going to wipe this down, guys. Hold on. One that works great for the uh, personal trainers inside a gym is basically getting the membership list. If you're working at a gym and you don't think that you have any clients to get, I mean, you're sitting on a gold mine by having all the members just right underneath you. All you need is for the owner to give you the membership list. Um, get all the old members that used to be a part of that health club too and contact them back too. So you have the membership list. This is a, this is one of the hottest hottest pieces of strategies I can give you. Is as a personal trainer inside a gym, uh, th this is probably the best thing I can give you is the membership list. All you need to do is contact the members, and it, for every member that you contact, have them bring in somebody with them. So try to get the gym to offer a two-week gym membership for new people. Tell them that you're going to be hitting the phones. You're going to be calling all the members offering a free personal training session with nutritional counseling and that you'll be having them bring in somebody with them. So if the gym, whoever's selling the gym memberships is any good at it, so they can have somebody come in and uh, they can uh, get the gym, the, the new prospect in that whoever's going to be selling the gym membership, they can offer them a uh, no enrollment fee and uh, if they sign up like today, you know, and if they don't wait the two weeks and, uh, you know, that could last a week. So you start signing gym members up in the first week, your health club owner just loves you because you're bringing in more money, you're bringing in more people. It doesn't cost a dime to get gym members. So what I want you to do is get the membership list. Get the membership list. And then we're going to get referrals from the members that you call. So you have the membership list you're contacting. Hey, uh, is uh, Brian Daly there? Brian, this is Jason with uh, whatever gym. And uh, I'm offering free personal training sessions uh, for you and a friend. Uh, what time would you like to come in and do that? Do you have time tomorrow to do this with you? I have an opening in my schedule. See, what I did is I didn't give them any room to speak. That's very important to do. And just don't ask, hey, would you like a free personal training session? You know what I mean? And leave it open. That's terrible to do. What you need to do is say, hey, I'm offering free personal training sessions to all the members. When can I get you in? Is tomorrow good? I got tomorrow at 1 o'clock. So you like, boom, you blow them away. You know, and this makes it look like you know what you're doing, too. You're not some uh, beginner personal trainer. You have to be authoritetic almost. You have to go out there, put yourself out there and just know that you know what you're doing and, and know that you know what you're controlling is the, the sale itself. So you're controlling the sale and how the sale will go uh, just on the phone. So this person's a prospect. Why should they want to train with you? Well, it's free for first of all. And then second, uh, they have seen you maybe in the gym working out, which is a good one, or uh, if they maybe they've seen you working with other clients and that works well uh, putting befores and afters all over your gym if you don't have befores and afters go on the internet and go get some befores and afters and throw them all over your gym act like they're yours for God's sake and just make it until you can get your own befores and afters up and just uh, use the befores and afters off the websites you can get whatever you can find out there and just get them and use them and uh, all it is is a sales pitch on how you will affect their body so it doesn't matter if they're not yours anyway because you can do the job, right? So that's what I believe is you can do the job so you can use somebody else's befores and afters and show them this is what you're going to be able to do to them. This is before, this is after. Another great uh, sales strategy that I use for a lot of people and that teach a lot of trainers is by using technology, which means if somebody comes in and they're sitting in your office and you know that you're, you've done a great orientation, um, you want to sit them down and you want to sell them the personal training package. I want you to take a photograph of them 
maybe you have an iPhone or something, uh, just your cell phone, just take a photograph of a person and then flip it around and show them to them. So Mrs. Smith, what would you like to change about you in this photograph? So what, what body parts and this and that, you know, and, and what they're doing is you're changing their mindset because now they're looking at themselves, you know, and, and they feel, they feel you on this now. So they understand what you're trying to do for them because when they visually look at themselves, they say, oh my God, I really need to change my body. I'm sick of this. There's a trainer sitting right in front of me. He can do the job. I know because he gave me a great orientation. I know this guy's the guy for me or this girl's the girl for me. They are the f f most fantastic, energized personal trainer, and I'm going to I'm going to do this with them. So you got to get you got to really change their mindsets, guys, through that orientation is very important. So we have the membership list. Uh, another way to do this is by uh, asking the owner of the uh, facility if they got good email data. Uh, they got a good email list uh, in their computer systems that they can send out an email blast uh, first to offer a free personal training session with you and then you can make the phone calls because then you can set it up to say hey did you get our email we were wondering if you got our email because the personal trainers are offering a free uh, personal training session with nutritional counseling book and uh, we're gonna do the nutrition with you that same day and the offer stands for two people so your friend is also going to get a two-week free membership and uh, then when you, if you sign on for training after that uh, we'll tack on an extra month of free membership with you so there's all kinds of ways that you can maneuver yourself to be, uh, put yourself in a position to be one of the best personal trainers that offers a lot. It makes it look like you care. You're not always out for their money. Um, you got to give sometimes to receive. So once you learn how to do that, you're going to be a fantastic personal trainer. You're going to sell top-notch personal training to everybody that walks in front of you. Um, I used to sell, people be like, I used to sell like 10 out of 10. Like I, I, there'd be weeks that I wouldn't miss people. I would sign literally everybody that, that would walk in front of me. They would all walk out with something. And there'd be other trainers wondering how I did it, but it was through the magic of what I'm giving to you. It's the orientation, it's the passion, it's the energy. Um, it's just uh, designing ways that, that I know that work for, for salesmanship and to make sure that you're doing a great sale. Um, it's from that first phone call that I know that if I make any uh, adjustments, like if you're you're on the phone with the member and you say, hey, would you like a personal training session? They're just gonna be like, no. But if I say, hey, would you like a free personal training session? My name's Trainer Jay, I'm with the so-and-so health club. I uh, would like to give you and a friend a free session. Can you come in tomorrow and see me? I'm gonna do your nutrition for free too. Plus I got two free tans for you. Oh yeah, sure, sure, that sounds great. See, now I put more value onto it. So now I added the tan. So you can use the cross promotions that you have out there. And tanning is probably one of the best ones that you can give away. So if you can give a free tan away, that's awesome. If you can get a free week or 30 days of tanning away, maybe the health club itself has tanning. And that would be great. So if the owner's smart enough, he's gonna let you as the trainer start giving this stuff away. And you can make it up within the personal training finances and then the extra person that they the that uh, member brought in that you asked on the phone hey can you bring a friend with you we're going to train two people i do small group personal training love to train you and a friend uh the energy's real high it, it's just it burns the fat faster it's going to be an hour-long program i'm going to train you for 30 minutes and then we're going to do a 30-minute cardiovascular exercise plan my way you know and then this is just a fantastic way to get people uh just loving you, interested into your personal training, the referrals start coming, it's just nuts. Make sure too that you have in place your referral system too. Uh, the best referral system that I have, and uh, I know may maybe you guys have seen it, a lot of guys are using gift cards and, and stuff like that for boot camps, but these gift cards have been used in health clubs uh, for memberships and personal training for the longest time. So what I'd like you to do is use gift cards in your personal training business and put the value behind those gift cards you know make sure that those gift cards have that tanning the chiropractic visit this and that so any client that you sign up you're going to hand those gift cards to give them three to five of those gift cards but make sure that they you stay on them about these gift cards so gift cards
gift cards are great and everything, but you need to stay on your clients about them. So if you just hand the gift cards on them, you need to make sure that you know who has these gift cards. And then in one week from there, you need to be picking up that phone or talking to them in on the studio floor or their gym floor and asking them, yo, where's those gift cards? I mean, you have any luck with them? Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna knock off $100 off your next month payment for every person that you send to me. So um, every one person is worth $100 per month. Don't get ridiculous and start uh, training people for free over that. So if you send me one person, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give you half off your next month's session uh, or your next month's payment. Uh, you can do, uh, I'm gonna give you, you send me five people, I'm gonna give you a month free of personal training. Uh, you can do lots of things. You're gonna make the money up, guys, in, in, in doing the referrals. A, um, time is money, so if you think that you're training people for free, hey, this guy's nuts. No, look, you'd have to spend money to make money anyway. So all this is doing is your time. So what you need to do now is get a personal trainer, train, get, get a new apprentice trainer to train your old client for that free month. So if they're not gonna resign with you and you have no decision on just giving them that free month, um, make sure that you have that in order too. So you don't wanna just be giving free months away too and then people don't resign because you're giving them free months away. So watch out for that too. It's always better to re-sign a client than just give free months away. So it's always better to probably knock off the, uh, the money um, for their next month's situation. But if you know that they're not going to re-sign and you know that somebody's just uh, dragging this out for three months and that's all they can afford with you, then offer them the three months or the free month if they're going to send you five people that sign with you. If they send you five people, you're okay. So you get an apprentice personal trainer to uh, start working under you. Make sure that it's okay with the gym. So ask the gym owner, walk up and be a businessman about this or be a businesswoman and say, hey, I would like to do this. I would like to make, I would like to increase my own profits. I would like to increase the health club's profits and memberships by starting to put personal trainers underneath me. I'll take care of my own marketing. I'll take care of everything. Unless you can get the gym owner to use some of my marketing strategies, I got great programs for gyms to increase not only the gym memberships, but increase the personal training while we're doing that. So I did this because I want to make you look good and get the, uh, the health club owner to take care of the marketing, pay for the marketing basically. So if you can get that, grab that first before you even state that, uh, uh, that you'll, you'll pay for all your marketing. Maybe you'll pay for some small marketing you know, strategies like the gift cards and, and uh, business cards. Uh, you trainers out there with uh, business cards too, make sure that your business cards have value. Um, you want to be able to put, put a week of free personal training on there with one free tan. And uh, put also on there, uh, go, go to this website and get this free ebook. And uh, you know, you really need to have ebooks up on your, on your website too, uh, to, to capitalize on every, every little thing that you can possibly do uh, for your personal training business growth. Um, there's a uh, there's a great place where you can go to get, if you can't afford personal training uh, websites and you want I don't want you to spend thousands of dollars on these websites anyway I'm gonna write something down here E L A N C E or it's E L A N C E dot com, Lance dot com. They're pretty much under five hundred dollars for websites. You can either do that, so Elance dot com, www dot Elance dot com, E L A N C E dot com. Uh, pretty much under five hundred dollars for websites. Uh, you could go to Blogger. You can set up your own blog um, just by going to Blogger. That's free, and uh, that's pretty much. You know, if you, you got to have a website these days, though, and you got to use um, strategies like YouTube. So what I want you to do is do a, do an abdominal routine on YouTube, and uh, uh, make sure that you uh, get yourself. Uh, YouTube, when you're using YouTube, make sure that you put the headline up there, abs, uh, YouTube, um, abdominal fitness, 
ab frying, ab burning, ab incineration, something like that. And then inside the uh, inside the the uh, where they allow you to write some information on yourself, make sure that you put something about yourself inside there and get your website noticed inside there um, by having it uh, kind of hyperlinked back to your website. So if you can get yourself on YouTube and get it get it get people to get hyperlinked back to your website, then that's a fantastic way to build your traffic on your website and just uh, kick butt as a personal trainer in your local area. Um, you also want to make sure that you're putting video up on your website. So if you can get video on your site and uh, video testimonials on your site, that works very, very well too. I mean, that social proof is basically everything when it's a personal trainer. So if you can interview somebody, I know it's a little uncomfortable to interview a, a client, but if you can, you can interview your clients. I'm telling you, it's going to work so good when somebody goes to your site and they see somebody talking to you about the personal training experience that they had with you, everything that you've changed in their life, how their life is now because of your services. I mean, it's a, it's a guaranteed sale. People are going to blow up your phone because of these video testimonials. So get those video testimonials and get video testimonials somehow, some way. Get your friends, family members to do video testimonials if you don't have clients yet. Do whatever it takes to get video testimonials up onto your website and uh, post this stuff up on Facebook and, and keep this stuff so you can use it over and over again. Get that stuff, kind of stuff up onto YouTube too. And uh, video testimonials, strong, powerful uh, testimonials from your from your uh, clients, and uh, you know have your trainers doing the same thing too. So you have your gift cards. Let's go back to the gift cards. So every time somebody signs up, you're going to hand them three gift cards. This rotation and this cycle keeps continuously going, guys. This never stops. You're always giving gift cards out. You got to keep this cycle going. I told you, if if I have trainers that can't afford uh, gift cards, what I have them do is go to Vista. Vista.com and they get uh, like $2.99 for 500 business cards, but I have you put value on them. So put the value on the back of the card. This, this card is worth a week of free personal training. Uh, call now um, and uh, go to this site for this ebook. You know what I mean? So you're putting value to your business card. To, to, it's, a, it's a start. Now, plastic gift cards go a lot further than the uh, ebooks will or the uh, business, the, the paper business cards. So if you can really, I, I highly advise that you go get the plastic gift cards. And I'm going to show you where to get the plastic gift cards. Um, and uh, ask for Tim when you get the, go to this. So we have plastic gift cards. So where you're going to go is called PlasticPrinters.com. So it's www.PlasticPrinter.com. I want you to ask for Tim and tell him Global Fitness Explosion sent you. Jason Ferrero, Trainer J, knows me as all three of those you can say, but he's going to take care of you there. I already have it set up for you guys to be taken care of with them. So go to Plastic Printers. There's another one too, but I like plastic, plastic printers the best. But plasticprinters.com and uh, uh, plastic uh, plastic plastic gift cards online.com. So there's two of them. So you can use plastic printers though. Tim Tim's a good guy. He'll take care of you. I've already set this up. I've been using them for quite a while, many many years in fact. So uh, use this. So it's www.plasticprinters.com. So go to plasticprinters.com and ask for Tim. So let's get into your uh, card itself, your referral card. Uh, I set my my personal training referral cards are worth $250. Uh, I have value on them. Free chiropractic visit, uh, two free tans. This card, by the way, is worth two 
uh, it's for good for two people. Uh, so I have a referral built into this card already, and I also got the health club that my one personal training, I'm talking about one location here, uh, my one personal training business is inside a health club, and it, it uh, allows me to bring in people anywhere from two weeks to 30 days. So this time we did two weeks. So I got two weeks at the gym. So that's two weeks somebody can use the gym. Plus, they get one, one personal training session. They get one tan. They get one chiropractic visit. Or actually, they get two, ta two tanning sessions uh, each for each person. So each card is worth uh, $250 in value for two people to come for two weeks, get a free personal training session. Oh, also, they get a nutritional packet. It's a nutrition for life packet that you guys also can get on the uh, website. And guys, nutrition is easy to do. Any one of your clients, don't send them out to do nutrition. Um, just do nutrition on your own because a lot of trainers miss the boat when it comes to making an extra income off of nutritional uh, uh, nutritional products. Um, there's a lot of people out there making a ton of dough off of nutritional products and you could be one of these guys too. You can literally retire very early off of just the nutritional products. But you need to find a, a multi-level business uh, to work with. Uh, there's many, many businesses out there. I don't want to th start throwing names around right now, but uh, there's multi-level businesses out there. Find a nutritional multi-level business that you can work with that takes care of your clients and gets them on a repetitive way of ordering uh, nutritional, nutritional meals, uh, drinks, uh, supplements, multivitamins, and things like that. So you're helping this person become more, more balanced and, and, and everybody these days needs this. We're so nutritionally lacking in so many areas as, as human beings, it's unbelievable. So once again, guys, all this is is a trade-off in life. These people that you're talking to as prospects that want to be clients, that you want to make clients, you need to explain to them that they're already spending money. The average person spends anywhere from two to three to four to $10,000 a year on bad habits cigarette smoking, doctor visits, medications, uh, drinking alcohol, um, drugs, uh, sex, uh, just d not doing the right things, eating, overeating at home, eating out, drinking lattes, coffees, teas, you name it, they do it. And they spend thousands and thousands of dollars. I've taught people over the years, just to, instead of buying a single bottle of water, at the uh, local store that costs you two dollars almost these days to buy a whole case at Walmart for three dollars. See these small little changes in people's lives that you can offer to them helps you obtain the money that you need for them to pay for your service. So you got to start thinking like a businessman or woman and uh, changing the mindsets of people and going the extra mile to change their lifestyle so you can uh, so you can make it so they can afford your services. And once you're able to make somebody afford your services, they'll stay with you forever. You can sign 12-month agreements all day long with people paying $250 a month. If you're especially if you're in a great demographical area, so if you get people paying 250 bucks, you can get two clients training every 30 minutes. That's $100 an hour, guys. That's $800 a day. You work a 12-hour day here and there. I mean, you're gonna kill it. I'm telling you, man, you're gonna kill it. And this is how I've done it over the years. In, in the beginning of my career, I did uh, sign a lot of big contracts. I would sign people for $75 sessions for six months at a time and uh, I would even double those people up. So I'd be making a hundred and some odd dollars, 140, 150 bucks an hour uh, sometimes in my, in my career. But you know, this all comes down to the demographics of the area that you're in. Um, you know, if, you're, if the demographics are low income, then you, you know, you're gonna have to charge less money, but you just do more heads. So you can still make the six figure mark, you just gotta learn how to do it by having nutritional, um, uh, counseling in, in your programs, you can offer that as an extra, uh, you can charge an extra 100 bucks a month just to do that for somebody, keep track of their their logs and, and show them how to eat correctly. Um, you can add little knickknacks like that onto your personal training business 
um, and uh, increase your income like like crazy. So if you charge an extra hundred bucks a month, and you have ten clients doing that, that's an extra twelve thousand dollars a year that you just made. You know, doing people's nutrition on the side. So think about that as an extra income, and then selling the products and getting what a multi-level business that would really see what multi-level business pays you the best. And, and, and find one that you believe in the products and then go study uh, some materials on multi-level businesses. Go study some materials on business in general and, and uh, Tony Robbins has great books, Jack Canfield, uh, there, there's uh, Dr. Joe, um, what's his name, Dr. Joe Vitel, uh, anybody from The Secret, the, the book The Secret, the video The Secret, you know, there's, there's lots of ways to uh, get yourself re-energized and, and become a positive personal trainer and act and know what business strategies you're going to use to build this six-figure income. Um, the other way that I'm going to teach you now to, uh, to build a six-figure personal training business is simply by using other trainers. So um, on the next video set, we're going to learn how to use other trainers to uh, increase your personal training business profits. And this is volume one. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope you rewind this and watch it again so this can become a part of your life and make it make take action, guys, on this stuff. Don't just watch this and not walk out the door. I gave you so many, so much information right here that, that just this little bit of information here could, it's very powerful. I didn't say so much information, but powerful information that could change your personal training business overnight the first day tomorrow right now this could change your life so what i want you to do is stop this video if you need to rewind this and you need to watch this again uh do it and and watch this stuff at least once a month and like i said if you have um uh personal trainers that you, you that are working for you now i highly advise you some of the highest paid consulting clients i have are the ones that have their personal trainers studying this material Get your personal trainers under contract with you and then have them study my material. They can't go anywhere that way and plus I'm going to show you how to help your personal trainers build a six-figure personal training business underneath yours. So watch volume two. It's going to be uh, how to build personal trainers and build a six-figure personal training business underneath you. Okay? Have a great day, guys. I'm going to see you on the other end. Watch the personal trainer's Bible to a six-figure income, volume two next.